Welcome back to Bad Axe Bourbon. I'm Bobby. We're getting there. We're getting there. I can feel it now. I can feel it getting light. All right. All right. You can see we got Wild Turkey 81. Eddie Russell, his hands all over this. This is all Eddie right here. I'll get the sip in. I'll get some on the nose, get some on the palate. All right, before we get started, please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, follow me on TikTok, Instagram, also on Twitch. Twitch every Wednesday night with Raven Wing Saint, the official bourbon bullshitter. Follow him on TikTok, Instagram, Twitch. Getting ready to go on Discord, setting that up tomorrow. By the time you see this, I'll probably have set it up too. I'll give you more information on that. Corbin Cash, I ever saw where this hat's from. Corbin Cash is great, my most favorite ride on the planet. Everybody knows that by now. West Broad Apparel. A lot of hats I wear are from West Broad Apparel, those hose hats. This is a shirt they gave me. This is a cool shirt. You see it's a Jack Daniels fashion. Everyone knows I'm not a huge Jack Daniels fan. But I do like the script and, and what it looks like. It just reminds me of whiskey. It, it is what it is, right? I do like some Jack Daniels. J5 Fire Lids. Pad for the inside of your, your helmet. And you can personalize it. All my firefighter friends. Or anyone that wears a helmet. You know, for a job. <clears throat> if you wear a helmet, do you want J5 Fire Lids? dot com instagram i believe he's on tiktok too he just hooked me up and sent that to me it is cool i have another one that he sent me that i have in my helmet at work it makes it feel so much better and it's personalized let me set that right there it worked it's stuck fireboat by brody thank you brody that might be the best part of my set right there that fireboat all right let's get into this so i'm gonna get a nose on this this Wild Turkey 81. Oh, it smells good. It smells good. You know, I'm not into the screw cap, but I think they're trying to keep the price down. Ooh, that glass feels thin. Ooh, hear that? Hear that? Plastic cap. I'm not digging a plastic cap, but it is what it is. I believe Eddie said that he made this as a mixer but it's pretty light it's just if it's just for a mixer it's 20 bucks plastic cap okay you're gonna go through it if it's a mixer all right i get it keep the cost down all right but i heard some good things about it it's new to me almond thank you very much norcal liquors almond gifted me this bottle dude i appreciate it i appreciate everything you do for me i really do man i really do Ooh, that's a good note. You know, it smells like turkey on the nose. I got to tell you. It smells like turkey on the nose. It smells light, though. It does smell light. You know, everyone knows I'm a big 101 fan. Rare Breed, love that too. 101 is probably the most underrated utility bourbon. It's probably the best utility bourbon on the planet. I'm just saying. All right, let me get some on the... It, it smells good on the nose. A little bit of caramel, oak. This is a blend of six, seven, and eight year bourbons. It's pretty nice. Got some oak, vanilla, a little bit of cinnamon. Little bit of cinnamon. I don't get a whole bunch, but I get just a little bit in there. Man, it smells good. Let me get some on the palate. I'm not trying to make this too long. Mmm. Ooh, a little peppery. Sweet on the tip. Ooh, it's 81 proof. Whew. It's got a little bit of a little bit of burn in it. Let me see here. Let me go on the second sip on this one. Hey, I'm, I'm telling you right now, it, it's light. I like 101 a lot. This is 20 proof down. You know what I think about 80 proof, and they're sticking with the one theme, obviously at the 81 so at least the flavor profile is there it's a good turkey flavor profile i like that so if it's lighter it's made for mixing okay i can't wait to get an old fashioned out of this thing actually now 
I like one-on-one old fashions, but sometimes they start out a little hot. It, it might just start off where I really like it. Yeah, really sweet on the tip. It's a little, it tastes a little watered down, but the flavors are good. The flavors are there. I think I'll really enjoy this in old fashioned. Like I said, I can't wait to try this in old fashioned. I have a feeling this is gonna be pretty good actually. Yeah, I'm gonna have to make one now. Right after this video is over. Yeah, this is good. I, I'm pleasantly, I'm not surprised. I mean, I like wild turkey. They keep it along the uh, same flavor profile. A little bit light, a little bit light in color and light on the palate, but the flavors are there. I think it'll be great in old fashioned. If someone wants to sip on this with them, that's what they have. I'll sip on it with them. It's just a little lighter version of what I really like. I'll do it. Man, I recommend this for sure, especially for mixing. You know I'm gonna make a video uh, making old fashioned with this, right? And, 81 old fashioned. I'll call it bad axe 81 old fashioned. I'll probably call it. Oh, I gotta call it that now. Yeah, this is this is pretty good. A little light, but it's pretty good. I gotta rate it with some axes. It's really light. It's for mixing. I mean, I gotta rate. I can't rate it just for a mixing bourbon. Right? I don't have that scale. So it's above. I'll say it's above that. We go three and a half axes on this one. Three and a half axes. Thanks for my bad axe wife. She's the one to give me that half. All right. That's it. I almost knocked that bottle off until you see that. All right. Wild Turkey 81, Eddie Russell's own blend, right? Three bourbons went into that. It's pretty good. It's going to be especially good in old fashioned. I can just tell already. All right. Can't wait to try it. What do we like to say on this channel? Sure, and good bourbon with friends and family is bad axe. I'm Bobby. Thanks for watching. Till next time.